Hello world, this is CS50 web development and this is my website. So this is for the project zero. Okay, so as you can see there's a header uh, includes my website website name and this is my form which I can type my email. So one two three gmail.com some password and then I log in. So what I have done Okay, so over here in the head, I've included some um, very basic, very, um, as we can say, default meta. Uh, this is for the media query, and this link is for the bootstrap, of course, um, my CSS file. And as for the header, as you can see, it's quite easy, it's quite clean, because I've uh, constructed the CSS uh, the style in my CSS file and in this division I've included the form and it is arranged in the form of bootstrap uh, I've used the power of bootstrap to construct the columns and inside of that uh, I construct another column again okay so what if I log in so I've, after I've logged in this is my home page it's fairly simple, it's not much, except I've included the navigation bar. So as for the navigation bar, it takes out about three columns, and for the article it's eight columns, okay? Uh, and then these links are linked to the other pages. For example, about, yeah. So in the about.html, uh, it's more or less the same. It's more or less the same. As you can see, that's header, navigation bar. It's just that the article is a little bit longer. Now, of course, I've included this division, which is responsible for the space, for the space right here. So, so the article looks more clean to be read. Okay, uh, in my projects, I've included my uh, this example of my final project. Of CS50, CS50 introduction to computer science, and some other projects that are included here. So this is a table that links us to another page. So to, um, to make into another page, into another page. Hello world. Okay, thank you. This is assignment zero. Okay, thank you. Uh. I've used the target blank, target blank over here, so that it leads us to another page. It opens a new tab. Okay, uh, and as for index dot scss. Okay, so as you can see, I've included, I've declared some variables, some constants. They'll be used again and again in my CSS. Uh, my CSS is a little bit complicated uh, and this media query is responsible for the uh, flexible design so you can see that my words are a little bit smaller compared to at a full scale okay. and lastly I can log out and that leads us back to the login page my name is Tommy Wong and this is CS50.